I love Lazy Chabert films, I love Christmas films, I love Hallmark films. Needless to say, I was pretty excited about Christmas Waltz. This is the 2020 Hallmark Christmas film, directed by Michael Damien, written by Michael Damien and Janine Damien. And alongside Lazy Chabert as Avery, we have Will Kemp as Roman. And I have to say, I really liked it. It ticked all of the boxes for me. It's not my favourite Lacey Chabert film, but I did really enjoy it. And I thought the narrative was pretty compelling. It's very brightly coloured. It's a very bright, vibrant Christmas film, which a lot of them are from Hallmark. It starts off quite pleasantly with Avery going to a cake tasting. And I have to say the three cakes that she that she is tasting are three of the most gorgeous looking cakes I've ever seen. And I don't know if they are actual cakes or if they're made of, you know, polystyrene or whatever for the purpose of not melting under the studio lights. But whether they're real or not, they look incredible. They're Christmas themed. She's planning a Christmas themed wedding in, I think, 20 something days with her fiance, of course. And then five minutes into the film, the wedding is off. I'm not going to say why or what happened. I don't want to spoil it too much. But she'd also signed up for dance lessons for her and her husband. Now, I think... Starting dance lessons three weeks before your wedding, not the best, but they have very busy lives. Finally, they get around to doing these dance classes, but the wedding's called off. And Avery decides that maybe she should just do the dance lessons herself. Partly inspired by the, the dance school's owner, Roman, who is a very typical, tall, good-looking, handsome, romantic lead in a Hallmark film. And straight away you can see that there's a great chemistry between them and Roman is a, a very likeable character. I really liked him straight away. The same with Avery. I liked both of them. So they worked really well as protagonists. Loved the on-screen chemistry. I also have to say uh, John Tellen Church, who plays Nicky. I really loved that character. Great performance. Had a lot of fun with that character. I thought he brought really great energy to it. And obviously the film is all about Avery learning to dance, but also learning to rediscover herself. Because we learn that when she was a child, she did dance lessons and her mother kind of encouraged her to stop doing dance lessons because she wasn't very good at them. And encouraged her instead to focus on academia because she eventually went on to study law, etc. And I don't necessarily disagree with the mother's choice. Like if your child is very academic definitely encourage that but Avery actually enjoyed dancing so I don't think that should have been taken away from her and it's all about this new birth if you like this rediscovery of who she is and what her passions are while also embarking on this new journey in her life because one door has just closed she doesn't know necessarily which ones are going to be opened next and it's a beautiful story I really thoroughly enjoyed it visually it's gorgeous um did it inspire me to go and learn the waltz well, not really, but it did teach me some of the dance steps because we do get to see Avery learning some of the dance steps. And I don't know how to waltz, but now I feel like I know at least three or four steps, which is more than I did beforehand. So it's educational in that respect. Uh, very festive, very warm and fuzzy, brightly coloured, as I said, really vibrant, very crisp film with a lot of kind of fresh whites and silvers uh, and very bright reds and greens. It's a very festive film. I really thoroughly enjoyed it. As I said, not my favourite Lacey Chabert film, but she has done some pretty amazing films. Christmas Waltz, definitely a great film. Great cast, great performances. If you love Hallmark films, this is definitely one for you.